I'm gonna make this real quick. Went to the doctor the other day. Doctor department that I got this bruise right here. But anyway, told him I got a deep vein because I used to have muscles. And I told him give me a butterfly. Like butterflies don't got no rings. I said, huh? I think she injected me. He took all my blood out anyway. The doctor said my A1C, which if you don't know what it is, it's like diabetic levels and sugars, right? I'm not diabetic, I'm normal. Right, thank God. So, but when the nurse pricked me, I almost fell out. My wife said, stop acting like a big baby. I was so loud that everybody in the nurses started laughing outside. But anyway, I don't care if you in law enforcement for 18 years. If you get pricked with a needle, I'll pass out. But anyway, so, got some good news or whatever. So, she do lab work after she finished, right? Do some lab work. And the lady had to hit me twice, and uh, I was like this. I started shaking. My face turned red, and I said, "She said, don't you pass out on me. You're too heavy to be lifting up. And it was already done. So I think it lasted like two seconds and everything. I still, I still hurt it. Anyway, doctor said I'm a little overweight. I said, no, I'm not overweight. She cost about three pounds. And I got back on the scales. The 280, so I'm still fat. And then she said, well, I'm, I, if you don't lose some weight in three months, I'm going to double dose your medicine. I said, no, don't do that, please. I already hate medicine. So the good news is, she said, I could drink soda every other day. And so I, I haven't drank soda in two days. So I'm kind of fiending, but I'm not fiending. My eyes are tired because I need something to drink. But anyway, that's just the chemicals inside the soda products. They give you that urge and stuff like that. And that's why, you know, you need something to drink, especially if you drink every day sodas, but not liquor but sodas. But anyway, especially dark sodas. And so now I weigh 279. Yep. So if you calculate every two days, I lose a half a pound. And that's seven and a half to eight pounds of fat now, of fat. Because what soda does is it holds on to your fat. Then you got the sucrose, 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 that holds on to your regular fat. Then you got the insulin fat that comes for the pancreas and stuff like that. All that combined holds on, it latches on to your stomach. That's why you got fat. And if you don't work out, I used to be, you know, bodybuilder. You know, I had an eight pack I used to. But if you don't work out, that's what it turns into fat your muscles. And if you don't work out, but if you do work out now, eat 2,000 calories diet so you can weigh 200 pounds. I weigh 280. I gotta eat 280 pounds if I was all muscles. But now I'm kind of like fasting, not starving. But you don't want to starve your body. You know what I mean? You want to actually slow down. Stop eating processed food. Make sure you eat a lot of fiber so your fiber intake could be intact. If you know about fiber, you know that's supposed to be intact, not watery. So. But anywho, doctor wants to see me in three months. I'm trying to lose 40 pounds. That's my goal. Competition, by the bill, competition. You know, in four months in April. Realistically, should I go? No. I want to, yeah. So $150 registration, $150 to be a member. And then I go, I go like on the Swiss and I, oh, look at all that fat. Anyway, this is to you. Let the resolution get be blessed to you. Don't listen to nobody else. Lose your weight. Or it's all in the mind. All right, y'all. Deuces.